Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and welcome back to MLB The Show 18. So, today, going up against the Phillies, this is the second game in what is a three-game series. We've actually got two really important series to win before the All-Star break. As you can see here, starting off against the Phillies and then, of course, we've got a four-game series against the Washington Nationals to sort of cap off the week. Uh, it's all before the All-Star game. I'm going to be recording and uploading that next week. Um, we've got Cespedes so far playing in left field. I can't, I can't even remember, to be honest. But anyway, focusing on today, Seth Lugo on the mound, 2-1. and one. So he's only played three games so far this season, but he's played not too bad with that 3.63 ERA. So right now, we are still leading the sort of wildcard playoff position. But we're only one and a half games ahead of third, so we seriously need to get back on track. We did have a couple of big wins there, but last time out against the Toronto uh, Blue Jays, we unfortunately had a... Well, we had a four-run lead after just, after just the second inning. And then in the fourth inning, we just gave up five runs. It was just a multitude of embarrassing errors and just ridiculous moments, to be honest. I mean, it was so bad. I don't even just want to forget about it, to be honest. But back home in City Field... Here we go. Time to get back on this winning streak, I reckon, because we're going to need it if we're going to want to get through the playoffs this year. All right, here we go. Welcome to City Field, New York's National League ballpark in Flushing, Queens. Tonight, game two of this three-game series between the Philadelphia Phillies and the New York Mets. The Phillies aim to notch their seventh win in a row right after this. Seth Lugo gets the starting nod for the Mets. Dan, any thoughts? Man, he pitched really well in his last one without allowing a single run and picking up the victory. Let's see if he can bring that stuff back to the ballpark with him and make it two really strong starts. At the plate, Cesar Hernandez. And we are set for baseball here this evening. All right, so you heard it. Phillies seven wins in a row. Do all we can to stop that. From the stretch. First pitch of the night. And the first pitch oh, of the nice. ball game here is taken for a cold strike one. Oh, got him swinging on the fastball there. Nick Williams goes down for out number two in the top half. Hit out towards second. Right wow. to Cooper. Great start. Eight pitches They'll and they're all this gone. One to first in time, and that ends the inning. Phillies down in order. Now the Mets will step up for their first shot in a scoreless ball game. Jared right, Eichel come on, gets Mets. the starting assignment this. for the Phillies. Just get off to Dan another good Lisa, start. What do you got? Just got to hey, hold this it this time. A fun guy to watch pitch. Not necessarily an overpowering guy. Has an ERA in the low threes. But one thing he knows how to do, he knows how to pitch and he knows how to minimize damage. If you're going to have an ERA in the low threes in this day and age, you're doing a lot of things it. right. And this guy should be fun to watch in this one. Right back to work as the shortstop, Jose Reyes, digs in to lead off the bottom right, of what are we dealing with one. here? Oh, likes that curveball. Watch for that. Ah, First really pitch on its way. Yeah. There's a fastball right over the inside corner. These Phillies, Flash as they enter play here tonight, fellas. Come on, you got to move strikes and decay. Here's the first pitch to him. Oh, on come on. Deep to All the way. This All the way. All the way. See you later. Yes. Over the wall, a home Wait, run. was that over? Oh, I thought it was double there for a sec. Boom. Cespedes. Solo home run here on one the pitch and one home run. And even 20 home it's been a while since we've home it with UNS. The That'll bring it up to, I think, 18 or 19. Guys throwing peach strikes. I just could not get 
any decent contact out of them. And we see four pitches already, two outs. Got that one though. Just. Oh, and that was really close to a long out. The left fielder had a beat on it, and he gave it a great effort, but he couldn't quite bring it back. Instead, it's a trip around the bases. That must have been pretty close. I just hit the fence. Wow. Two head effort for him, including a home run in last night's game. Turned on down oh, the line. Lucky and that finds its way through for a base hit. Well, this was a good start for the pitcher. First five guys, five uh. up, five down, but the number six hitter proved to be a little bit more difficult, and that's a bullet hit. Yeah, absolutely right there. Dan. Just a nice AB that. by the six hole guy after watching his first five brethren take a seat. In now, Jorge Alfaro. And a first nice. pitch swing. He hits a fly ball to left center. And Lagares will look this one in. Easy that stuff. Is the All right, we had a little bit of a one scare there. One on first, but they trail this one one to nothing. Bruce Flores and Cabrera up next. Here's Jay Bruce now. He'll start things out against Jared Eikhoff as this inning gets underway. <coughs> yeah. Come on, Jay. Against the shift as usual. Now here it comes. Hard hit and oh, deep hit toward well, the right field line. And that'll get down out oh, there no. for extra bases. Throw into second. Shit, shit, shit. But it won't oh. be in time. And it's I thought a that double. Dan, from here that, that looked like right it um, there, made it. Six game hit streak well, hit the, you know and this could be to the right of the line. But some, some bigger maybe and better not. things right here. He's been swinging the bat pretty well and he's been rewarded for it. As you talked about, six game hitting streak so far. Set. Here's the nothing to nothing pitch. Yes. Thinking line drive out to right center. And that'll land between everybody. Base hit. And they'll put the brakes on at third. Runners at the corners with nobody out. Hey, this has the makings of being a pretty big inning, D Row. Lead off double, now a base hit, and all of a sudden we're looking at first and third. Yeah, sometimes you wake up, you just get smacked in the mouth right here. He's going to have to start executing pitches. He cannot leave a ball over the heart of the plate right here. Now, it, it's amazing house. how well we can do when we get stuff to land. When we don't, it's quite horrible. But... All right, come on. Here now is his dribble Cabrera, batting left handed here as he takes a look at strike one. Ooh. Career Money. line against Jared Eikhoff. Should have sent that one good. back in. Five for 12. Strike oh, two. Damn, they slide is With two me. strikes now and a runner at first, do you go for the strikeout or are you still looking for the double play ball? This is a great spot to be in as a pitcher. You have two strikes, you Come can on, bury get down. one for a potential strikeout. And it will. Oh, meanwhile, wow, how what about a play. that for a play? Laying out to take away That's a right. hit. Wow. Get to sacrifice, Not but the damn, that was a catch. runner from third crosses the plate. It's a 2 0 ball game. Boy, this one looked like it was headed for extra bases off the bat. Instead, a line drive bullet caught in nice. the alley, but he does end up getting a second a strike. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But hey, I give him credit. He's really working the oh, count right here. Not Here's that big of a threat left with field the bat. And Fuck deep. Off. Look at this. And it's gone. God damn it. Ugh. A solo shot here to left. Eighth home run on the season for him. And the Phillies have cut the lead in hit. half. It's now a two to one game. Yep, this is why you just can't rely on I must one have pitch. Missed big time These are the best he just nailed hitters that. in the world. The and when they know anyway, what's coming, they're going down. to jump all over it, just like he did there. Is it? Yeah, I mean, it's pretty much down at the knees. How the hell did he get that up and away? Batting <sighs> ninth, pitcher, Jared Eichhoff. Into the box, Jared Eichhoff. As he drives a liner oh, to right kid. center. And oh, the pitcher's got himself hey. a base hit. Legs churning. He's headed for second. The throw into second. Not in time. And he's in there with a double. 
This is exactly what happened against Toronto. What the fuck is going on? Another ah, shit. Home. No. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Fortunately, the bobble won't cost him a run as runners will stick at first and uh, third. Boy, there's a bullet base hit right, right there. Down the wheel, yeah, yes. the hold there, D Row, to make sure that gets through and isn't caught for a line drive. Damn it. Play. Yeah, you have to play the game right. Don't think for one second, after giving up already one homer, that he doesn't know where this lineup's headed. He's going to have to face. Oh, for fuck's sake! How? This ball is belted high uh. in the air left. How did he get hold of that? My God. So a three-run blast to straight away left, and that is 27 for him on the year, and it's given the Phillies a 4-2 to two lead. How well, the hell? Well, he won his last start, but he didn't give up any long balls. He's already given up two here, so he's got his work cut out for him if he's going to get the W on this one. He's going to have to start keeping the ball in the yard for starters. It's the exact same thing that happened against Toronto. We came out with a... These are the great matchups that happen throughout the course of a game. I don't think as a pitcher you can give in right here. He's a great hitter at the... Oh, my Swing God. And again, are you serious? Again. This one to deep center. Gone. Back to back homer. I don't know what's going on. This is ridiculous, man. This Oye is actually Como becoming a joke. It's a solo home run for Carlos Santana. Home run number nine on the year. Like and how? Just like we that, pitched the first two, two innings. <clears throat> like absolutely perfectly. Like what the hell's changed? Wow. Boy, when this guy gets in a groove, he can hit him. And when he hits him, he hits him in bunches. Hit a home run in last night's game. And if they continue to pitch him on the outer part of the plate... Stepping in now, Aaron Altair. Hot shot down the line. Oh my god. And boy, the Phils just keep right on rolling as this will be extra bases again. And he'll reach second now with one away. Everyone knows that this guy's numbers are not where he wants them. Going here. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Here's Cespedes oh, with a drive. all the way. That's two for two. Left field. Come on, Ioannis. In the second deck and go. 415 feet. That's sorry. That's 21 home runs. So two pitches tonight and two homers back to back. All we need is another seven Cespedes on the team, and we'll be we'll be fine. But well, that at least that gets us somewhat closer. Lead off home run in the fourth. Well, one of the narrative tips today's game has been driven by the long ball. We've seen these squads go deep a combined five times in this one. Yeah, man, it's all... Now the one and one pitch. Line toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. So a ringing single here to centers on the ledger for the Phillies to this point. High in the air out to center field. Cespedes is there. And the inning nice. is over. Come Phillies on. strand one as they hang on to their 5-3 lead. <laughs> Josh Cowan will grab Come the on, bat Josh. and hit for the pitcher here. Number eight, Josh Cowan. And a fastball misses here to start the at bat. It's one and zero. Oh. Uh, needed no, to lay off that no. pitch upstairs, but it's one and one. Oh, it looked oh like he was God. coming anchor there. One and two. Pretty late with the swing there. As a pitcher, you have to recognize that and. Keep coming in with the hard stuff. And yes. He, proves he can hit it. That gets God, down, this guy is and good. And the inning continues. So a great job on a one and two pitch to keep the inning alive. Kind of looked like he had gotten his bearings there. Dan was going to have a one, two, three inning, but not the case. Giving up that late two out knock. Boy, this lineup is so deep. One these guys to finally, finally start making some real dollars in this game. 
swing and he's able no. to play this one out to left. And that's in for a base hit. Make it a one for three games so far. Hey, sometimes that's how a rally gets started right there. I know it's a no soft matter. liner, but leadoff man on usually poses problems. Adam Rosales will stride in again, and before he takes his cuts here, let's flash you back to the third inning. This was just a solo shot, but it definitely helped get this offense going. Throw on to second, so they'll get the lead man, and that's all. Ready once again, Jared Eichhoff. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. First pitch of the at-bat. Showing bunt here, but he takes ball one. In today's game, if they're going to give you an out, you take it. You have to find a way to execute a pitch in the zone. Allow him to get the bunt down and take the out at first. Reyes on to first. Yes! They get the what a play. Out of the inning. So no runs on one base hit, no errors, and no one left on. Two, three, and four do up in the home half of the sixth. It's the Phillies five and the Mets three. Yeah, Matt, they really do an awesome job rallying the Mets and getting more fans yes. brought into the whole movement. But one of the things I love yes. most about the group is how well they travel. You see cheering sections in other cities, but these guys go all over the country, invade sections of visiting ballparks to root for the Mets. It's pretty impressive. Yeah, it's a well-organized group, believe three for it or three. not, that holds several events throughout the year. They even take their act on the road to visiting ballparks a couple of times each season. Oh, that really is an great error. for the Mets organization. Here's Todd Frazier now. He swings and grounds get it through. Short, yes. And that gets through for a one oh, this is it. Hit. This is it. Dan, that hit right there extends his hit streak to eight games. Are you aware of stuff like that? No doubt about it right now. He's swinging the bat really well. And after that knock Come right on. there, hey, listen. Come on, Jay. Eight games is nothing to sneeze at. So you can say, hey, he's going to whole calendar week with. Yes, Jay. Meanwhile, this ball gets. Light down. it up. It's a base hit. And they'll hold that runner at third as everybody moves up a base, and they're loaded with one away. Boy, this looked like it could have been a quick inning, get the first out, and then boom, 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 three singles, and all of a sudden they're loaded with one out. Yeah, this is execution at a situation. That pitcher's got to execute a little bit better. That was almost a non-competitive pitch. Yes! Almost the black out one go. All right, one away. This ball gets down, it's a base hit. And the runner from third scores as they try and work their way back into this one. It's now a five to four ball game. He was able to spit on that first slider right there, guys, but he didn't let the second one go. Able to execute and drive the baseball. Come on, lads. Here's the Philadelphia manager on his way out to the mound now. And we're going to see a pitching change as that's going to do it for his starter here tonight. Luis Garcia was called upon to pitch, really needing that double play ball. Bases are loading him up. It's full three and Come on. two. Kevin Ploiecki, the number eight hitter here, waits on deck. Here comes the payoff. Pitch. Yes! And that misses. Ball four. A run will come in. Wow, I would not have made that pitching change. Tied up. to the pen because they like the matchup. And what does he do? He walks the first guy he faces to bring in a run. So, so much for that strategy. Makes you wonder if they'll turn to him again. Gets harder and harder to hit. This is a big spot here. Softly no, hit no, third, no, 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 shot no, no, two. no, 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 Swing and a liner. Oh, lucky and that's going to be a base hit. So there's the possible go ahead run aboard to kick off the seventh. Take a look at this again in slow motion. He tracks this thing all the way, gets his hands quickly to the zone, and just rips it down the left field line, just how they draw it up. Oh, bollocks. <laughs> And the yes. goes away in unceremonious fashion on a swing and a miss at a ball way outside the strike zone. So it's no runs on it. Jose Bautista is up off the bench as he'll be asked to All right, come on, Jose. in the home half of the seventh. 
Come on, man. Swing and a miss on the slider, nothing in one. Matchup numbers with Luis Garcia. He's one for four. Yes, pounded down the, the middle line. and in for a base hit. So with Sorry, that, the down Mets the line. have a runner aboard to get the inning underway. Up the guts, I should say. Straight down the middle. So, if we can just get one in this inning, I'll be really happy we can control the game. The 0-1 on its way. Oh. And a pitch takes off inside and gets away. That and helps. A very big mistake as that'll move the possible goal. Check your ego at the door. Something has to be elevated and put into the air. Yes. And that will get down as he delivers a big one here. It's a base hit. Coming into score. There it the is. Third and they've taken the lead here in the seventh. Boy, those have to feel really good, Dio. You just get late in the game, you come up with a big RBI base hit right here to give your team the lead. Yeah, no one remembers that ground ball with eyes in the top of the second. Got the big man the up. Crowd come out on. of it and slow yourself down enough to come through. Oh, and that's exactly again. what he did. Four for four. Here's your one money. And that's in there. Absolute money. Man, talk about having a good game. And like most guys, this would be a good week. Four hit of the game. And two of those d rolls round trippers. Yeah, he's going to have a smile on his face for a while here, Dan. These are special nights. You have full advantage of it. Here's Todd Frazier now. A swing and a ball. Yes, to Todd. Field. That's going to get down for a base hit. Loaded him up. And a good throw is going to hold that runner at third. So they're loaded now with only one away. Hey, guys, this, he's not known for being a singles hitter right here, but that's his second knock of the game. And I'm sure he'll take him, but the guy's on the other side. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Dribble no. to the right side. Fucking hell. He'll come home with it. They get the force at the plate. The turn throw is in time. How about that? They do turn All right, well, that's not what we wanted. Fuck. I cannot get Jay Bruce going at all. I mean, what the hell is that, out of a man? Tight spot. Why am I swinging at that? That's More night baseball after this. Damn it. Hansel Robles has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Digging in now. It pitches in some big situations, Dan, and the offense took full advantage. Yeah, you know, Dero, one of the things about pitching is you want to have location, and it was obvious in this one today that oh, the pitchers dude, weren't on point, on the, and what happens when that pace. happens? Hitters make out. you pay, and the long ball was a big part of this one here. The leadoff hitter finds his way on base. Should be interesting to see the cat and mouse with the manager. Does he use the bunt right here? Do we put a little hit and run on? Do we go old school, new school, and just let him swing away? Should be interesting. Into the box now. Jorge Alfaro. No balls in one strike. Mind the right side. In there, a base hit. And that runner Fuck. will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Boy, d -roll when you're starting to swing it. Jerry's familiar. On and away. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep hitting that spot. Oh, it's on the ground to second. Did he get his double Come play? On. One there. Yes! The first in time, and just like that, the side is retired. So they pick Oof. up no run. Talk about a substitution, bringing no familiar on for road list. Wow. Made that work. Made that work. The eighth, straight ahead. The Mets lead it six to five. The seven train making its stops just outside City Field. All righty, so here we go. Inside. We've got one, two, three up at the plate, the show. and we've got our closer on the mound. Come on, let's do this thing. First pitch of the at bat on its way, fouled away. Come on, Jerry's. Oh, and one count, and the pitch lifted the yes. other way to left center. Ligares is under it. One out. Yes. This will be a massive save if we can pull it off. Right 
Ready for another Come shot on. now. Nick Williams. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. First pitch is a sinker for a called strike one. Bases are empty, one man out. Money. And that's in there for strike two. Two great pitches down in the zone. Interested to see where he goes now. Does he bounce something in the dirt? Does he go elevated fastball? A lot of options at hand right now. Nothing in two count and the pitch. A swinging yes. runs up the third baseline. Oh, and no time oh, to get him no, 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 no. That's speed, out. That's definitely out. Single. You know, Dero, no a way. Could be so frustrating. You're taught to try to go out there and make all he the got pitches. That. And no that way. was a really good pitch. And I would be willing to bet oh, you he's surprised my gosh, that, that was turned close. into an infield single. That was yeah, ridiculously day, close. He's smiling. That hitter smiling, running down first base, knowing he's got an infield single right there. He has no business. He'll line out probably 15 times, but it won't even out. And it's over. First, a double play. It and is over. The ball game is over. Man, they battled Boom. right to the end. Getting the tying run aboard in the ninth, but that's where the threat ended. As they turned to double Commentator play says this battle this it was one, definitely a battle. Holy and crap. We were 2-0 up, an up an then we were 5-2 down, five and then we were 6-5 up. I mean, wow. What a game. And never gave the lead back. Zach Wheeler claims the win out of the pen his first. Jerry's Familia works two full innings in relief to record the save is 22nd. So that's well, a wrap so Zach for really us gets here tonight. From Fair enough, he didn't give up anything. And Dan and our but in the end, I must admit, uh, been watching MLB the, show. the big man Cespedes probably won this game for us. Two runs. Look at that, four for four, two runs, two RBIs. Four runs in total, to be frank. I mean, that's crazy. No wonder we're going so crap this year and last year for the Mets in real life, you know, missing out on Cespedes is basically just like half the team's not even playing, but 22nd save for Familia and 22nd home run on the season for Cespedes, so there we have it. We've uh, stopped this seven game win streak by the Phillies, but we're going up against the Nats on Thursday, so definitely stay tuned for that. That is a massive game that we have to win, or a massive series that we have to win. And until then, I'll catch you guys later.